Hello, in this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to do a reset on a Windows device. Now, as you can see on our on our Maximus 2 here, I forgot the password. So what we're going to do is we're going to do a reset. Now, unfortunately, doing a reset means it's going to reset it back to its original factory settings, meaning it's going to act like you just bought it. So in order to do this, what you want to do is you want to take your mouse cursor and you want to go all the way here to the bottom right hand corner here under power options you want it and you want to select it once it's going to give you three options restart shut down or sleep now what you want to do is you want to highlight restart but we're not going to click on it just yet what we're going to do first is we're going to press and hold the shift key and while holding the shift key we're going to click on restart so now what's happening is it's going to be loading right now now, as you can see, it just now as you can see, it's taking you to this menu. So, in, while in this menu, you want to go to troubleshoot, followed by reset this PC. So, after clicking, it's going to then ask you give you two options. It's going to ask you to keep your files or remove everything. For this case, for in this case, we're going to select remove everything. So, click on that. And now it's going to take a while to reboot it. It'll take about maybe five to 10 minutes. Go. Okay, it's been about five minutes or so. And as you can see right now, it's setting up, it's setting up the, fin it's setting up the finalization, finalization process for the reset. Okay, it's been about five minutes or so now. So now it's going to give you two more options. Now what you want to do is you want to highlight and select just to remove my files. You're going to, you may be tempted to select, to select this one, but this, but this option is incredibly bad. Do not select this. You want to select just remove my files. So we're going to select just remove my files. Now it's going to ask you to um, say it's ready to go and say it's ready. All you have to do is select reset to reset it. Before you do this, you want to make sure your device is properly plugged into the to the wall. As you can see here, it is. And now you just want to select reset. And now, right, and now your your iView Windows device is now resetting. The process is going to take is going to, is going to take roughly about an hour or so. So in the meantime, just leave it alone and let it do its thing. Um, and 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 once it, and it'll take you to the welcome screen once it's finished. And that is how you reset a Windows device.